Hey Cancers, K Pisces from KPisces.com. I'm here with your April 2015 Love Edition Love Scope. Alright. Okay. Got my cards. Okay, Cancer. What am I feeling about you? Oh boy. What I see is a bunch of doors slamming in your face. Ooh. Okay, there's a lot of things going on here. I feel like there's some door slamming in your face it's like you it's like you're sitting in the middle of a hall but the doors are all around you in a circle and every time you turn around a door slams okay and the door that and the only door that is off to the side is locked so um ooh, and then I see um like a, a toilet flush like down the drain so ooh. Mm, mm -hmm. Okay, well let's just let's just let's get into it. Let me just do the card on it. <sighs> okay. Oh, things are feeling dismal, you know, and abysmal, and it kind of feels like um, there's some regrets, and you feel like you have to stand back from something, but. It's just some last minute regrets or something like that, but it feels like doors are being slammed in your face. So let's let's do just let's do the cards on that, okay? Okay. Mm hmm Okay. What I got? First card. Ace of Pentacles reversed. King of Wands. Ten of Pentacles reversed. The Emperor reversed. And on the bottom of the deck was the Knight of Pentacles. What I feel like these cards are telling me is that there was an opportunity for, okay. Okay, it feels like, okay, yeah. Okay, with the Emperor being here, let me just explain it this way. With the Emperor being here, the Emperor is telling me that there was a situation in which, or several situations in which, you were in, in power of a of a emotional situation okay which was this way but somehow turned upside down okay it looks like the action that you took wasn't the action that was the right one because okay so this card the ten of pentacles upright is like a family okay it's a family happy home you see the kids the dog where the kids at oh there's a kid down here by the dog Kids, dogs, family, more of a family situation type thing. Okay, but with the emperor being here, the okay. Where we at? Okay, with the king of wands. Okay, he's all about action. So the king of wands makes decisions. He does his thing, whatever. He goes for it, whatever. So the king of wands went for it, blah blah blah, whatever. He got into it and he felt like, uh, no. Either I made the wrong decision for my empire or my kingdom, whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. okay, so with the Knight of Pentacles, every time I see this card, I know that there's some feelings somewhere that you have for somebody that you're not expressing. You're not telling them how you feel about them. Now, I don't know if the feelings that you had changed or... Okay, with the door slamming in your face, I kind of feel like this is saying that you may be afraid to go forward with your feelings or how you feel and expressing how you feel. Back to where I was. <laughs> I had to cut off for a second. So, um, holding back with the feelings, not sure what to do with it, not sure where to go. Okay, so with that feeling okay we got this one handled i don't know if you feel you're afraid to move forward with this thing it kind of feels like um you don't know what to do okay now with the five of cups here there's sadness involved in the situation now like i was saying with the king of Pen the, the king of wands being upright the decision that you made turned out to be not so great of what you felt it was. You felt like it was the wrong decision but you're not really sure which way to go with this thing because you're not sure if you can go forward with where you want to express your feelings you know what i'm saying it could be two things you could not want to go back on the feeling that you had 
or you could be wanting to take your feelings somewhere else. I really feel like this means you want to take your feelings somewhere else. And this could have something to do with the decision that you felt that you made that was a wrong decision, but we'll see. Okay, so next card, Five of Cups. Okay, the Five of Cups is sadness. Five of Cups is sadness. I really feel like this sadness card, okay, it's like sadness and depression. I mean, I'm not going to say it. It don't have to be a depression, but it could be, you know, just general sadness. I feel it's associated with the decision that you made. And now you feel like there's no other way to go. Like you have no option but to either stay in the decision that you're stuck, that you feel kind of stuck in, or the door that you're trying to open is locked. You feel like it's locked. Maybe you should knock on it. I don't know. Okay, so let me just keep on going. All right. With the King of Cups here, the King of Cups is water energy. So it's Pisces, Scorpio, uh, Cancer. So with the King of Cups being reversed, I really feel like you feel kind of unsettled in this thing that you're in. You feel unsettled. You don't feel like it was probably the best thing you should have done. Okay. And it, and it kind of feels, I just feel uneasy about it. Like you're not sure which way to go with this thing. Because with the Knight of Pentacles here, the Knight of Pentacles, he doesn't really move too much. What he does is he stands back and he try, kind of surveys the land and tries to decide which way to go with this thing. I kind of feel like he's nervous to go forward with how he really feels. Like it's like it's something he wants to say to more than one person or he wants to say something about the bad decision he felt he made that he's not really sure about. And the other option, maybe it's another person or whatever. Um, you're feeling like um, with the door being locked, I think you feel like the other person has locked the door on you. Oof. Okay. Oh, but the lover's card. Okay. Now this could mean, okay, this is obviously a love relationship. So obviously you're feeling like, <sighs> I think that the, the door that you want to open is to someone who may have locked it on you because if the door was just closing you could try to open it but if you feel like it's locked that's another story like what do you do i say you knock on the door and see if you can get an answer <laughs> but i don't know okay the hierophant is here the hierophant's relationship that's not going so well okay when you're in a, the hierophant that comes up is relationship somebody's not really feeling and it's not feeling like a good relationship i think okay 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 you may have gotten into this relationship with this person because you were feeling that it was going to be conventional. Like it's it's too like when the higher fun is upright, it's more it's um, saying that somebody is in a relationship that is conformity. It's like you're doing the relationship because this is the way it ought to be. Okay, with the higher fun reverse, it could speak of a relationship that's not the norm of the relationship, but it's still a relationship. You know what I'm saying? There may be a little little different, a little kink on it. I don't know, or maybe just not the stereotypical relationship view but it's still a relationship but justice being reversed you really haven't made your mind what you want to do about this thing okay in april so far but again with the two of cups coming reverse the relationship that you're in is just not looking good like it was okay with the devil here the devil's reversed and this is telling me that the thing that you're the decision that you made to go to wasn't you don't feel like it was the right thing for you you're not feeling bonded to this situation I just keep seeing two sides. You don't feel bonded to the situation that you're in now, okay? The Queen of Cups is here. And the Queen of Cups, her ass is reversed. Queen of Cups is a motherfucker, let me tell you. Again, this is a water sign, female or male, I guess in this instance. Uh, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer, okay? It could be any one of these women. Now, this bitch is reversed. And when this bitch reversed, she ain't nobody to fuck with. I mean, you want to get away from this motherfucker. <laughs> You just want to be El Dono with this bitch out. I mean, this motherfucker is not happy. So maybe this is the thing that you're experiencing now is this person is very, um, she can be very insecure, very upset, vengeful, secretive. I mean, the Queen of Cups reverse is, maybe this is a person that you're dealing with or a person that, it is just all bad with this bitch. Just saying, okay? With the judgment here reversed, again, another card that says that you're not sure about what you want to do. It's like you know what you want to do in your heart, but you're not really sure what to do. So with judgment and justice reversed, um, I think that what these two are saying is that you haven't come to the decision because you haven't really been able to talk about the decision that you made and 
and decide what it is that you really want to do with this thing. But I really think you've been thinking about this thing a lot with the Hermit Reverse. You're really ready to come out in April and say what it is you really feel because the World Reverse is feeling like, there's a lot of reverse cards here, Cancer. I mean, mm. okay, with the World being reversed, this is telling me that the situation you're in, you don't feel like it's going anywhere. You don't feel like it's going to go anywhere. And the situation, and the other situation is blocked because whatever the reason the door is locked, um, that somebody locked you out, Oh yeah, it's stressing you out, okay? You're thinking about it and the situation that you're in now, you're ready to walk away from simply because it may be some feelings there between you and the person that you're dealing with, but it's not the feeling that you're looking for, okay? So Cancer, with the death card, um, you want to move on to something new. Not necessarily just something new, but the situation, you just want to end the thing that you're in right now. With the Empress being reversed, it, it it don't look like this person is somebody that you want long term, okay? And I just feel like you want to walk out of this thing. With the Nine of Wands, this is you probably waiting for the other decision. Or maybe you're waiting for somebody to unlock the door. The other person, I don't know. But it kind of feels like that. Like, okay, with the okay, with the Nine of Wands here. He's battered and bruised. He's been through the ringer with this situation. He's tired of it. He don't know what to do. But he's really just waiting around for an end to happen. You know what I mean? But really, Cancer, seriously though, you gotta make the end for yourself. You, you, it's not gonna fall in your lap. Like you gotta end this thing and go on to something else. But you really, really feel like this thing ain't going nowhere. Oh my god. So with the with the Eight of Swords here. This is you opening up and going ahead and okay so when the eight of swords is upright this is somebody holding back from another person they're not speaking usually when i see this in a relationship it means that these people aren't talking to each other or they may be just they holding back from each other for whatever reason it is you're not talking to somebody for some reason that person holding back from you you holding back from them but whatever it is y'all ain't talking when it comes out reverse it is saying that somebody got to talk or you need to have a conversation with that person okay and with the sun here the sun is upright. This is really good. Um, I feel like when you open up and you talk to the person about the situation is that you're dealing with, um, I think things will work out for you. It's just you're feeling deadlocked and you feel like it needs to, some kind of conclusion has to happen because what you're doing ain't working. All right, Cancer, if you're Cancer and this is happening to you, I would just encourage conversation, I guess, to see what's going on with the other thing and try to state your case, I guess. Um, yeah. If you're a single cancer and this thing is happening to you and somebody's not talking to you because whatever reason it is and you feel like you're in a bad position, I just say you need to have that combo and just be done with it. All right, guys. Kpice from Kpice.com. You can hit me up for tell all no holds barred reading. No lies, no lies, no lies. If you want to lie, look in the mirror. Don't come to me because I ain't got nothing for you. All right, guys. Check me out. Bye.